All right, what's up everybody? This is uh, Nate from The Comeback Kid and this is my very first vlog. And so today I'm going up to Carson, California for the uh, US men's national team match against Bosnia and Herzegovina. The journey to 2022 starts now. Uh, 2022, it's very far away. A lot of guys trying to get their first cap, so follow along with me and we'll see what happens. to the tailgate about four hours left until the uh until the match starts i think uh i think kyle martino is supposed to be here so that's that's pretty exciting why are you why are you here today for what some would deem uh meaningless friendly support the future i mean the the, the the team, uh, they, they called in a lot of youngsters, and I, I love it. It's obvious that we missed the World Cup, and that's a huge, huge negative. So time to usher out the old and bring in the new. Who are you most excited to see today? Uh, I think Tyler Adams. I, I love what he has. I love him for your Red Bulls. I like seeing him on the November Friendly at Portugal. Uh, I think he's got a lot to offer. All right, thank you, Steve. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> Which players are you most excited to see today? Uh, I mean, for me, I'm looking forward to when I got into January camp, it was about opportunity. It was about a few players that were young and were on a bubble and trying to make a World Cup team, trying to make an impression. It's basically this entire roster. Everyone here has an opportunity to make a big impression because there isn't a, a, a game that, uh, that really is going to count for another year. So now's the time to go for it. All right. Thank you so much. Yeah, of course, ma'am. So it's about an hour until the game starts. Uh, they just announced the lineup. Uh, really no surprises. Uh, Bill Hamid in goal. Uh, I was hoping to see Zach Steffen, but who knows, we might see him in the second half. And um, this is the future, and I'm excited to see it. A few minutes later. Hey, he put it wide! Still nil nil in the 54th minute! Woo! A little longer than a few minutes later. Alright, so the match just ended. It finished up uh, nil nil. The second half was more exciting than the first half, but still, really, no performances to write home about in terms of players who are really looking to break on the radar screen. And Jordan Morris was the man of the match. Uh, Bosnia and Herzegovina did miss a penalty, so in reality, the U.S. should have lost this game. The road to 2022 starts now. Thank you, everyone, for watching this. Please uh, like, please subscribe, please share with your friends. Uh, this is Nate from the Comeback Kid signing off. In the